So let's get started here with the first round. It's going to be round uh, 64 in the ESL. Uh, enter the Nexus Cup, powered by Steel Series. And we're just loading the first map now. It's going to be Garden of Terror. And I would assume that Empire definitely has the better lineup here. We've not uh, seen their support yet, but we will in just a second. And, well, I mean, standard, pretty much standard picks. Arthas, Tyrael, uh, Raynor, Vala is in there, which is maybe a, well, a little bit uh, offbeat, but still, you can take her. Okay, let's get started. The battle begins shortly, heroes. On the left side, we have in the blue trunks Team P Terra, and they have Illidan, Diablo, Lily, Muradin, and still at the gates, seconds. Nova, their opponent. Five, on the right side here, on Dragon, uh, three, on a Garden two, of Terror, it is one. Rainer, Vala, Arphis. Rhaegar, and in the bot lane, Tyrael, and they are Team Empire. And Rhaegar was their last pickup, so Rhaegar is going to be their support, and we have Arthas and Rhaegar waiting down here in the bushes. Nova has finally joined the lane, and I think she saw Muradin entering the bushes there, yep. She knows what's up. Oh no, never mind, uh, <laughs> everyone's still waiting down here. And first little engagements up here. No, Rainer's being pretty careful. Actually a nice combo here out of uh, Illidan and Diablo. Let's see what they can accomplish down there. But we do have that first little engagement. Muradin uh, did try to get a stun off against Abyss. But he did some nice, nice dodging there behind the minions. And Rhaegar? Oh, Rhaegar and Arthas already going for the easy camp. That's a nice early pickup. Uh, Rhaegar did get some damage in, but I think uh, they'll be fine just taking this out. And it didn't take that much time, so this is actually going to be a strong push da coming down the bot lane here. And Abyss is going to like that. So far, he's uh, doing a good job standing his ground against Mirrodin and Nova. And it looks like Nova is gearing up to try a gank here. Oh, Vala is completely out of position. She might be in trouble, and there we go. Nova goes down on her, but she gets away for now. He, oh, cleverly dodging behind the bushes. Good job out of Team Foley. And the seats are up. Reyna's gearing up to take some seats here on the top of the map. Nova and Mira are down here. I think they saw what Empire is up to. No, not yet. Should have seen it. Oh, and they're going for it. Muradin jumps in there. Lily heals him up, but not doing a good job so far. But Muradin looks like he gets away. Uh, Empire really focusing on, on the seats right there and completely forgetting about uh, about Pitera. But Illidan moves in. He tries to get a gank up on Vala. And oh, Diablo, what is he doing? Completely out of position. And no focus fight out of Pitera. Illidan is going to go down. This was just easy fodder. For Empire, good job in that engagement. Uh, Pitera definitely have to step up their game if they want to uh, if they want to stay in this game. And Lily scouting out, okay. Not going for the boss yet. Oh, and completely out of position. Oh wow, she just gets ganked. Four against one. That's not even fair. Diablo is again up there. He sees what's going on. They try to get in the better position here. Illidan is with him. But Nova still in the middle lane. Nurdin comes in from the bottom. Maybe they can get gank up on uh, on Bella, but she strays away. And Kaladin jumps on top of her, but she's doing a good amount of damage right there. And Tyrael jumps in. Nice takeout on Illidan right there. Bella still up. Nova doing some damage on her, but looks like she might be able to jump away. And again, already five kills, six kills out of Empire. Wow, a really strong early game showing out of them. They really need to recuperate their losses, otherwise uh, Pitera might be in trouble here. Tyrael joins the mid lane again. And they're not really missing any XP here. Almost two levels up already. And the first Terra has spawned. 
coming up the top lane. Asphil is in the Garden Terror, and they're just gonna push down the top lane. And already two levels up, that's really strong. I might even hit level 10 here uh, before the six minute mark. Uh, they don't really want to engage yet. Um, gotta say, Pitera's doing a good job holding this off for now. But Yurden taking a lot of damage there. He does jump away and does a good job getting away. Gate is gonna fall here any second now. Asphalt making sure of that. And with the gate gone, they can march in there. Ooh, Murden jumps in. Oh, uh, he's being body blocked and taken now. Good job. Asphalt just blocking everything there. He's just so massive. And Diablo also falls. Now they can just take up the fort without any real issues. Uh, Pitara wants to try to get back in there, but oh, geez, so much damage, so much. Such a difference in levels here, almost three levels up now, with the fort gone, yep, they're gonna be three levels up, and jeez, they might even hit level 10 before the five minute mark, it's gonna be tough. They would've picked up another, another gank here, I think they might've made it. But now this gi does give them the time to take the hard camp, uh, go for the easy camp uh, simultaneously, nope, Tyr is actually joining the lanes again, Valor Captain lane. And they're really going up in XP. Uh, this might be one of the fastest Garden of Terror um, games that you'll see ever. And there we go. Cake up on Nova. And she's taken out so quickly here. They're already level 10. Uh, almost four levels up. Three and a half levels up right now. They're gonna take up the uh, take up the fort right there. Oh, Diablo wants to gank up on Tyrael. And they have actually three players down here, so mm, this could have worked. But they were, they were missing the follow-up stun out of Voodoo Noise. I mean, he's really their, their main stunner in this composition, and I mean, it, we, did, we did say this beforehand. Uh, it, it is a really weird team composition out of them. Oh, Empire's gonna go for the hard camp. Oh, just adding insult to injury here. And, did manage to um, regain control here on the mid lane, but at what cost? Top lane is being pushed down by knights, bot lane is pushed down by knights, and Team Empire on it. And they're not even level 10 yet, while well, Empire is almost level 12. Wow. <laughs> if you've ever seen a ruffle stump, this is it. And plants are up again, but looks like Empire is not even gonna go for it. They have the knights, they're just gonna push down on the bot lane. And I think they can probably take this game right here and now. Hours are falling. No one's moving back out of Pitera. They want to get those seeds in. But it takes them forever to just get that Garden Terror down. Now they're moving back. They're not even porting back. Oh, jeez. I, I think this might have been their first throwing in any competitive uh, Heroes match. And I gotta say, Team Empire is really showing them who's boss. They're gonna take out this keep. No real issues there. Oh, nice slam on Rega here, and they're doing a good job focus firing him, but he gets away. And they're just five levels up. I don't think I've ever seen such a dominant play out of Empire. There comes to summon Diablo, he gets taken out with Tyrael with a deep dive in there. And I think they can just go for the next key. Did have a disconnect here on Heops, but he's back. And uh, it's gonna be the next gank. Illidan taking a lot of damage. He gets away. Murden taking a lot of damage now. He jumps back in there. I don't know if that was the right idea. And they're gonna go for the tower. They might even go for, for the Nexus right away if they want to. They have so much sustain with that with that amount of, of levels uh, ahead of Pitera. Wow, that's just nuts. And I think they're even guarding. Yeah, they're guarding the um, the Garden Terror. They can even can't even channel it and. If the 20 seconds are up, they just miss all their seeds. And there comes the next engage on Murden. He's he gets away, but Lily is taken out and Diablo falls as well. And there come the Reynos Raiders. Illidan jumps in, but he's just taken out so quickly here. Five levels difference. And that's all the difference they need. Um, just an incredible stomp out of Empire. This is not even funny right here. And now Garden Terror is gone, and they're gonna push the Nexus, and they're gonna get it done so quickly. Bloodlust comes out on Rega. It takes a decent bit of damage, but with with the Nexus just falling so quickly, 
This was the fastest Gardener of Terror game you've ever w witnessed right here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, I I'm just dazzled. I'm just bedazzled by Empire. Um, hopefully this doesn't discourage Pitero from uh, competing in the ESL again.